The dream of shaping a new future began with building a beautiful five-star rated energy efficient building to house the Terry Deacon Nanobiotechnology Research Center and then setting up the best facilities to attract the best minds to answer the best questions for society. The questions we're asking for these students are important not only for India, not only for Australia, but for the whole world. And through the research alliance we have, the students will also get to work both in India in a top class laboratory. They also come to Australia for up to a year of their studies. The centre aims to nurture PhD students as the next generation of research leaders who can address the world's most critical problems in the areas of agriculture, environment and human health. Some of the exciting research that has already taken off includes using green agents like bacteria and fungus to degrade toxic waste from the metal industry to extract minerals such as zinc and iron and reuse them to fortify a nutrient deficient crop like wheat or creating nano emulsions that can release pesticides with far greater precision without harming the environment. Students at the center are synthesizing nanoparticles from plants and fruits to produce safe natural colors for the food and cosmetic industry. And finally, they are applying photobioreactors to mass cultivate microalgae and derive multiple products from it such as biodiesel and rich nutrients like beta-carotene. The Terry Deacon Nanobiotechnology Centre brings together Deacon's cutting-edge expertise in nanomaterials and the Energy Resource Institute of India's extensive biotech experience. It is a great honour for Deakin to be involved in this partnership with Terry. Terry has a strong reputation in India for creating a sustainable future, especially in the areas of health and food security, areas of great importance to both our countries. Mm -hmm.